What's up guys, it's me, it's me, it's that not a VFC one here and today we're going to be doing the part two of the wealthy warrior with my mate Bobby and my lamp. Yes, but sorry for not ending off the video, it was a bit disaster of course. Yeah, we've named Just, it part one. We don't need to yet, so part one, go check that out if you've been watching this before this, that would be great. And um, please like, subscribe and share that because I didn't say that in the last video. So, yeah, let's go. Back to me. me. Back to Bob. 200k. 200. Would you open a fortune cookie? Yeah. That accurately mm. tells you the exact date and time of your death. To be fair, I would. You would? Because centuries. I would want to know when I die. Like, so I don't worry all the time. So, what would you say? I would say no, because I didn't want that day to, like, no, yeah. and I don't want to dread that day and, like, yeah, the wishing. For and one be able to would you rather yeah. again, and I give up caffeine forever, or give up alcohol forever? Alcohol. Same, I'd always give up alcohol. Because... I'm yeah, not, I don't drink it. alcohol as you could probably see. Because we're too young. <laughs> and and we're, I don't even want to. Want and to. I don't even want to. Arsenal are one nil up now. But I probably I am going to eat it. So I'm going to say give up alcohol. So back over to Bobby. For 200k, 200, would you chop off? Seven random ponytails, as in like, yeah, yeah, on the back of your head. At the crowded movie theater. Uh, would you? We, to be fair, yeah, yeah, so would I. Seven, seven two, 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 three. Three. Three, yeah. Right, my so. question. I'm getting a bit. Funny. You know, would you rather this time? But. For 8 million, would you press a button that blows up an uninhabited, uninhabited, uninhabited planet outside of our solar system? Mm -hmm. 8 mil. Do you know what? I would. Yeah. Because the chances are it's uninhabited. One, that won't affect anything on it. Two, the chances are no one will actually know what it is. Mm. And free, just eat meal. Yeah, I know. You're rich. Mm. So, next one. Bobby's got the would you rather. 13 million pieces of jabroni. Would you sound like Kermit the Frog for the rest of your life? Or be like it. Darth Vader for the rest of your life? Or, I'd probably or you could keep your money. To be fair, I'd... I'd obviously... Do one of them. I won't keep. I won't let him keep his money. Yeah. I probably do like Darth Vader. Same. I would. Forty-seven percent agree. Bobby probably already knows the answer to it. So. For one meal, would you wake up tomorrow one foot tall? No. I know that. Cause, Cause you're small. I love it? being a midget, and it's really fun. Mm -hmm. So, so, tall people come the F at me. For 40 million, 40. would you rather have truly evil 40. parents yeah. or have truly evil children? Oh, to be fair, I wouldn't want evil children and I wouldn't want evil parents. Can it keep his 40 million? I want nice family though, so. Uh, what would you say? I'd say. To keep my money. 40 mil, I know. I'll go have truly evil children. So 36% disagree with yeah, us. but when you're older, when you're old, when you're me, old like 35% agree with us. When your grandparents, they'll be like really mean, and they'll be really mean, I don't say. So. Okay. The next question. Paolo, what's the thing? 
five mil, would you rather be handcuffed to Tom Cruise for a year or be handcuffed to Kanye West? Tom Cruise, definitely. No, not Kanye Who Kanye would want to be handcuffed to Kanye West? Not me. That's like your worst nightmare. Mine. 50% agree, so I've got half in the majority. For two million pounds, would you perform a voodoo ritual that causes NBA star LeBron James, like the best, well, like yeah. currently the best NBA player in the world, to have a career ending injury? Mm, yeah. Um, no, I wouldn't really. I wouldn't. No, no. 54% disagree. That's okay. So we're going to do two more each, guys. For two mil, would you blindfold yourself, place your finger on a spinning globe, and move wherever it touches you for five years? If you choose the ocean, go again. Uh, I'm not sure. I wouldn't. I wouldn't. You could end up in a really nice place, like you could stay in England or... You will say, or well, well, if you Russia go is very, very safe place right now. If you go in a place like Syria, which is wars going on and being bombed and everything, then not being offensive to Syrian people, so I wouldn't. Hmm. No. I would if there's not wars going on and everything. No, but what if it landed in Australia? That would be a good thing. Yeah, but the chances are he's not going to out of like 204 countries in the world. Oh, wait, didn't it say 196 different countries? See? Oh, on, on Wikipedia. It's either this or Wikipedia, so. For 9 mil? No. Would you kidnap in a. Would you kidnap a child in a third world country and raise it as your own? No. I would. That's just me, though. It's not. Yeah, it's kidnap a child. Mm. Let's do it. So this is the last my one. My last one. And well, we've got I've one I've already had... No, I've had my last one. Have you? Yeah. For so 100,000, would you crash 10 weddings and yell, I object every time it, it's asked whether anyone objects them to, marry, to the marriage? That's a lie. No, sir. 100k. No, I wouldn't. 44% agree. This agree. No, they do agree. So, thank you for watching, guys. Please like, subscribe, and share. Stay tuned for another. Peace. 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 Bye.